Today, I'm sharing seven chic but cool style formulas for the summer. Stay with me. Hello ladies, I hope you are having a great summer. Can you believe it is summer? That is so exciting. I'm, I'm loving it and today we are just talking summer style inspiration. I don't know about you, but this is how it kind of goes with me. I buy the things, I, I get my closet all situated, and then within a week or two I feel like I've worn everything and I'm run out of ways to wear things. So today, I simply want to give you seven summer style formulas that make it so easy. And if you would just simply even write these down like formulas like this plus this plus this, then you will have your style formulas and you can find absolutely every one of these things I bet you in your closet. There may be one or two pieces I'm introducing that you don't have, but I think for the most part, you probably have everything in your closet. You may just not have thought of ways to wear it. One of the things I'm learning about summer is really, you know what, let's keep it simple. Simple is cool and it is chic. And really right now, simple is really trending, just to really go simple. But there are a few other things that you can do for your summer outfits too, to make them really cool and chic. Okay, before I go much further, let me say hello to those of you who are joining me for the first time. My name is Kay, and I'm so glad you happened upon my channel today. I upload videos here every Wednesday, really targeted to women over their 50s, but I know I have viewers under 52, and I'm so glad. I dress a very casual but modern styles aesthetic, and so if that resonates with you, then I hope you will stick around and subscribe to my channel. And I also blog at dressformyday.com, so be sure to check me out there. Of course, I'm on all, all the social media, Facebook and Instagram, so I would love it if you would follow me on those places too. Let's connect there. But now let's get on to those summer style formulas because these are, I've got seven of them. I figured that's one for each day, right? And then we are gonna go through them fast. Here are a few things I wanna tell you though. All of them you're gonna notice I have included lightweight, as lightweight as possible, breathable, natural fabrics. Things like cotton and linen and silk. Yes, silk for the summer is a great option because it too is breathable. Also, I am using some style hacks to make these outfits come together and I encourage you to do that. I have a video from last summer called Summer Style Hacks. It is still so relevant. Yes, maybe the links are not any good anymore. They probably lead to items that are not available anymore, but you're not going there to shop. You're going there for the style hacks. I'll give you a link up here and also in the description box below so that you can watch that video if you would like to. It's full of great style hacks that are specific for the summer. So that's why you wanna watch that one. You'll also wanna make sure that you have the right footwear for this. Now, these are footwear I bet you already have, right? They're I'm gonna be using sandals and sneakers. That's it, sandals and sneakers. So you probably have those things. And then don't forget to accessorize. So I'm gonna show you the basics, not really talk about the accessories a whole lot, but during the summer, I think it is important to accessorize, but to minimize. Like today, I have on some kind of some novelty earrings, little white earrings that I think really work with this outfit. I've got on some, you know, nice little catchy bracelets here, but I don't have on a necklace. So I'm really trying to kind of minimize, pick and choose your jewelry accordingly, your accessories. All right, let's here, let's go. Style formula number one is probably my favorite and it is just loose fitting, fun black pants. Mine happen to be linen, but you could go with a linen blend or a cotton jogger or something like that. Just these are fun black pants, okay? These are cropped, these have a balloon shape, they happen to be linen and I am wearing a tee, just a graphic tee here, so it's something really cute and fun on it. Very simple, very pair back. This is so modern and fresh and young looking, and I am wearing my leopard print sandals. This is the time uh, to pull those out when you're wearing something like black pants. Um, I think it really works here. Now you could also wear some kind of really trending comfort sandal like Birkenstocks or even Echoes or something like that. This look is all about being comfortable and cool. So we're just talking about those really casual pants here. I really kind of think black is gonna give you that most modern look. And don't be afraid of black in the summer, especially if they're linen or cotton, okay? And that graphic tee, fun footwear, there you go. You have it, simple outfit. 
Number two is one that you've probably seen here before if you've been watching my videos, and it is just a fun skirt, white t-shirt, sneakers. I think I've shown this a couple of times here and at my blog because I love this kind of outfit for the summer. You probably have something like this in your closet. If it's not a colorful print t uh, skirt, then you probably have some kind of a floral or you have a solid skirt maybe some stripes, nautical or something, but pull out those skirts. Don't forget to wear them this summer. And I think really the best way to do it, to keep it simple, is just to add that white t-shirt. Here I am wearing that cinched front t-shirt that I love from Loft. We'll see if it's still available or not. It was just almost the, the steal of the summer, I think. Just such a fun t-shirt and just white sneakers. There you go. Outfit formula number three is those linen pants and an easy breezy tank top or t-shirt if you prefer a little bit of a sleeve. Really wear whatever kind of top you like with those linen pants. That is such a great style formula, especially for us women over 50. It's gonna keep us cool. It's gonna keep us looking chic. It gives us that, that maturity, but not like old woman, okay? You're not gonna look like an old woman. You're gonna look like a seasoned woman in these linen pants. I do think because I am wearing kind of blousy, balloony linen pants, once again, these are really full. I kind of even went oversized on these, that you really want to wear a kind of fitted t-shirt or tank. So rein it in a little bit up top if you're wearing something blousy and free flowing down below. Outfit formula number four is one of my favorite and it's probably where I'm really kind of living these days. And that is, a pair of cropped, relaxed fit pants. They're not jeans, they're not chinos, they're not joggers. They're just these relaxed pants that we're finding everywhere right now. Because of the situation we've been in in this world, all this work from home stuff last year, I think we're seeing so much of this relaxed looking pant. These are some I got from Nordstrom. They are readily available most everywhere though. I'll promise you there'll be lots of links to lots of uh, options in the description box below. I'll have links to everything in the description box below. I wanna make this easy for you. Now up top, I'm wearing a tank top and this tank top happens to be kind of a gauzy fabric and it's kind of an ecru color, but you could go once again with any kind of tank top. It's not about the tank top. It's about having what's, using what's in your closet and then using that linen shirt, or if you don't have linen, a cotton button-up shirt will work well, or a gauzy button-up shirt like what I have on today. Just some kind of over shirt over that tank top. I love wearing tank tops in the summertime, but I don't always wanna show my arms. I'm not always comfortable with that anymore, and I know many of you are not either. So having these button-up shirts, whether it's a linen, a cotton, or a gauze shirt is such a, it's just crucial in, in my closet, and maybe it is yours too. So I love this combination, this formula. I kept my footwear simple, and it just really comes together so nicely. This is a formula you could wear over and over and over in different iterations. Number five, let's not forget that simple summer dress. Now here's the thing, you bought that simple summer dress and you thought I'm gonna wear it all the time, but then you think, well, but I just wore it. I don't wanna wear it again, everybody will notice I wore it. But you know what, if you can do that dress in different ways, you can wear this simple summer dress with sandals and some pretty jewelry and you look all dainty and feminine. You can wear the simple summer dress though with your sneakers and that's a whole different look. And don't forget, you can top that dress. So here I'm showing you a red dress that I recently picked up at Talbot's. It's got kind of a washed red, so it's really pretty and just kind of fresh looking. It's a cinched waist and I'm wearing a striped, really what is a swimsuit cover up over this dress. But I, I bought this last year at Talbot's. They had it again this year. I don't know if it's still available, but the red just really works. It just gives this whole outfit such a fresh look. I've added my sneakers this time. Don't worry, I'm gonna show you one with sandals too. But here I love white sneakers with summer dresses. This is a great formula. I call this one and not done, right? Because one and done is what we call a dress, but when you add a topper like this, it really completes that look in a whole different way. Now let me show you, here's another summer dress, and this time it's got those nice diagonal lines, but I just am wearing it with a solid white topper. 
So, and I've got my sandals on. So however you want to do this, I'm calling it one and not done. So it's a dress with a shirt over it, whether it's a short, you know, button up shirt or a longer shirt like this, you do what works well for your frame. And I think that's such a great choice though for a style formula for summer. Number six, I'm wearing white jeans, white tank and a kimono. I love this column of color. Now that's what we're do doing here, really. This style formula is just a column of color. It's a column of white with a kimono. And I could put any of my kimonos that I have in my house, and I have several. I could put any of those kimonos over this white tank and white t uh, jeans, and it works. It just looks great. Just add some gold sandals or some nude colored sandals, whichever you want to do, and you've just got a great look. You could wear this every day and with a different kimono and nobody would even know. Now my last look, you could pull off with jeans, but I'm gonna wear it here with shorts just because I wanted to throw a shorts outfit in here. But just remember, if you don't do shorts, you can do this with your crop jeans or even your full length jeans. And it is just jeans, t-shirt, kimono. So once again, this time I'm actually wearing black jeans, shorts, but you could do it with your blue denim shorts or your blue jeans or your black jeans or whatever. So it's just jeans, not white jeans, but just jeans and a tank and a kimono. Great outfit. Again, once again, you can do all sorts of different things with your footwear. You could go animal print, you could go gold, you could go nude, you could go sneakers, whatever just another great style for formula for summer. I bet you have all those things in your closet. You work those formulas, ladies, for summer and you will look so stylish and pulled together. Don't forget to check out that summer style hack video. And hey, check out my blog this week. See how we're going there, working through some style formulas this summer also there. Thank you so much for being here. Be sure to subscribe to my channel if you haven't done that so far so that you can receive a notification every Wednesday when I upload new videos. You have a great week now.